If you're new to dictating, it can seem a little overwhelming at first. So we've put together a few tips to show you just how easy it is. Some users find it helpful to write out an outline or bullet points to guide their dictation. It can be just a few simple talking points to help prompt you through your thoughts so you can stay on task. SpeakWrite allows you to customize your dictation any way you like. You can always add instructions to the typist at the beginning and they will follow whatever instructions you provide as long as they are within the scope of service. In order to get the best quality work back, we recommend trying to reduce background noise and avoid speaking too quickly or mumbling. The clearer you speak, the better results you will receive. If you need to pause to collect your thoughts, that's no problem. No one is listening to you while you're dictating, so you should not feel rushed. A tip to remember, you're basically leaving a voicemail to your friend. Hey Tom, sorry I can't make it tonight, but I hope that we can get together really soon. While you're dictating, spell out the names of people and places as needed. The first time they're mentioned in the dictation, the typist will follow the spelling throughout the rest of the document, so you don't need to spell it every time. You will likely get a different typist for each job, so make sure to provide spelling at the beginning of each job. If there are names or places that you use commonly, you can add them to your custom word list inside of your profile. You can provide simple formatting instructions as you dictate. For example, next paragraph, please. Put that in bold or new heading. The typist will craft your document to follow your specification. If you do not include these specific instructions, the typist will use their best judgment to include them as necessary. The typist will not transcribe O's or ums or words that are clearly not intended to be part of the dictation. If your dictation includes a direct quote, just indicate quote, and end quote to capture the exact quotation. And lastly, you do not need to dictate any punctuation. Here's an example of a law enforcement dictation and how you can use the tips in this video to assist your transcriptionist with your document. This will be a report. Please bold and center report at the top. Next paragraph. On September 20, 2023, at approximately 6.30 a.m., I arrived at 123 North Street in reference to a burglary call. Upon arrival, I made contact with Paul Aylman, date of birth, 1-24-72, phone number 512-913-4534. Mr. Aylman stated that between the hours of 9 p.m. last night and 6 a.m. this morning, someone entered his home and stole his TV and his laptop. Mr. Aylman stated that when he arrived home, it appeared that his back door of his residence was kicked in. Next paragraph. This investigation will be forwarded onto CID for follow-up. See, that wasn't so bad. You now have the tools to be a dictating pro. If you need assistance with your law enforcement dictation, click the link in the description to get started with SpeakWrite today.